Welcome to La Vida Rosa. I'm your host Pinky and today I'm going to be trying this contraption from my childhood. You know, I never really used this or nor did I think I would ever use it on my hair. But today we shall see. Will this work for a three strand twist, two strand twist, just at all? Um, so if you'd like to see more than just stay tuned, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Oh, without further ado, let's see how this works. All right, y'all. So today I'm going to be trying a product that really has been around, I believe, ever since I was a little girl. Um, I never thought uh, I would ever use this product. I just thought it would be for uh, white girls. But turns out there's actually a use for me now that I am natural. And I actually saw, I forgot her name, but I'm going to leave her name right here and leave a link to her video down below i actually didn't watch the video but i saw her using it and i decided to look it up myself and i don't think i'm using the same one she's using i'm using more of an off-brand one mine is called the braid express and as you see it says similar to as what's seen on tv it wasn't what was seen on tv similar to this was made in china it took like almost three weeks to get here but it got here so and it was real cheap so the link to this will be down below as well and what i like about this one is that it has four prongs instead of like just two and i'm actually going to take advantage of that today because i'm going to do three strand twists and i haven't done a three strand ugh, i can't even hardly say it i haven't done a three strand twist probably since back when i first went natural because it's just like you once you get the rhythm going you know it's kind of easy but i just didn't feel like going through the motions of trying to figure it out again because three three strand twists are kind of like a little tricky but when i saw this i'm like i'm just gonna do th three strand twists with this hopefully it, this works out i've already put the batteries in here in these two double a batteries and um like i said it has four prongs and then you just lift one of them up and you stick your hair in the individual pin and it holds your hair down while it's being twisted um there are four prongs but like i said i'm only gonna be using three maybe one of these days i'll try four um and whenever you push it the the up button is a twirl and it just has like the individual prongs twirling and when you uh the bottom one is b twist and it's like literally the full thing twist around so yeah that's i mean it's pretty easy pretty simple nothing too difficult to work with i don't think we'll see um so let me go ahead and start i always start in the back i'm just gonna divide my hair into three sections I think this might be the mo most difficult part, trying to keep the hair separated. So I'm going to lift one of these up. And it, it holds it down. It's pretty snug in there. Is it on there? Okay, hold on, y'all. I got to just get the hang of this thing. Okay, now let me get the other one. Okay, I guess I'll twist it a little bit like that and then Oh <laughs> Um Okay, hold on. Uh Oh uh. Oh my goodness. Okay. Oh, okay. 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 I'm kind of scared. I don't want this to take my hair off. That did not twist to the root like I thought it would. Mm -mm. That didn't work the way I thought it would. At all. At all. I hope my hair is entangled. Okay, y'all. So, it's probably a week later i got so frustrated with this thing i lost the footage of me trying over and over and over for this thing to work but it kept doing that same thing that it was doing in the last clip and it just wasn't truly twisting i didn't really plan on twisting my hair tonight i was just gonna go to bed as is but i was like well since my hair is dry let's try this twist out real quick i'm gonna try twisting it the each individual first 
And now I'm gonna try to sit it up. Now I'm gonna see if that works. Let go. And this thing is hard like to unhook from your hair. Oh my goodness. I feel like that was slightly more successful. I feel like that one was slightly more successful. Um, but I feel like this is just, this is just not functional y'all. It's so much easier for me to twist my hair with my hands. And honestly what I think it is, let me show you. If I were to twist this myself, each individual strand is being twisted as I'm wrapping them around each other. And I think that's what the machine is missing. And that's why I tried to like, um, it had the function of twisting the individual strand and then twisting around each other. But I think it has to be like done simultaneously for it to actually, you know, work. Because look, that's gonna stay that ain't going nowhere but that other twist it just did that was too loose it just <sighs> more trouble than what it's worth i really thought this would maybe change my life maybe i had too high of expectations if i had to grade it i would give it a d because you barely pass and like it made a very weak twist maybe i'm just illiterate when it comes to this tool or maybe i'll try it again later i don't know but for now, this is a straight up gnaw. I don't recommend anybody, anybody, anybody use this. Cause I also feel like it's a recipe for disaster with your hair tangling. Like, Cause my hair is easy to tangle. And I just didn't like the way my hair looked when it was twisting with this. It just didn't, it looked like it was about to rip out. It just, the one good thing about it is it does stop twisting itself once it like feels like it's going too far it will stop don't worry i have more videos coming trying different things i've been like ordering up a storm let me know what you guys think down below have you ever tried that thing and if so tell me what your experience was if you have not are you willing to try it um probably not after this video well anyway i hope you enjoyed this video and i'll see you in my next one peace